Denise Brown says her pain was unbelievable. I used to have a lot of cruciating pain right here in my joint where I used to have to hold my shoulders and pinch it in to, to stop the pain. Brown says her back and neck symptoms started after two car accidents and led her to Dr. Charles Park at Mercy Medical Center. She works in the office, but she just cannot even go to the office because of severe pain and so forth, cannot sleep. Brown was diagnosed with disc herniation. So the discs are, uh, they're like jelly donut, you know? So outside layer is tough, called annulus. Inside layer is very soft, like a crab meat, like a jelly. And sometimes the outside layer opens up. Some of the inside material comes outside. So in December, Brown opted to have surgery to treat her herniated discs. She says she was nervous at first. I hesitated a lot about having the cervical um, neck done because I didn't want to get scarred. The surgery is called anterior cervical discectomy with fusion. Dr. Park shows on Brown's pre-op surgery x-ray where her discs were herniated. But here is what they look like afterwards. So these are the bones and this is the plate they were put in. Uh, there are two screws on each of the bones, and uh, this ver vertical lines are actually the spacers. Now Brown says she feels like a new woman. I feel 100%, 100%. I'm able to use my arms. Um, I don't have that pain in the back of my neck anymore. I'm not having headaches anymore. She only has one little problem left. The only other issue that I have is I need to find me a better pillow. <laughs> Reporting in Baltimore, Lacey Griffith, WBAL-TV 11 News.